hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you're all doing fine so today i just quickly want to give my thoughts on um something i found out about recently about um youtube bloggers jamie and nikki separation i just wanted to give my two cents on you know the whole situation um but before i go into it if you've not already please don't forget to support me by liking this video and please subscribe to my channel and also share this video with your friends so guys this is a very very um, sensitive kind of um, discussion um, the reason why I want to talk about it is because I've you know I've actually been watching um, their channel Jamie and Nikki for a very long time I believe I subscribed to them when they had about 40,000 subscribers if you're wondering who is Jamie and Nikki um, they are YouTube bloggers who are they, are, they have the interracial um, marriage and they vlog their life and they have two beautiful babies um you know i remember then people will be asking them to you know have kids when are you gonna have kids you know why they don't want to have kids but they were like they want to travel around the world first of all and everything but before you know it you know nikki got pregnant and you know they had their first you know beautiful baby girl and um now they have two beautiful kids um they've not been vlogging for some time now so after like a month because people started speculating like Rumors started going around like, you know, maybe they were they were broken up or maybe the guy cheated on her and all those things. So recently they put it on their channel that um they've um they've decided to separate. So everyone is making videos giving their opinion on why they think, you know, they actually broke up and I just wanna give my opinion on why I actually think they broke up and at least at the same time kind of give an advice. It's always amazing when two different different people from different cultures and different parts of the world come together because of love and you know care for each other love love each other and get married you know when it happens like this it means that the world is moving forward and we're having people uniting as if the world is getting better you know but one thing I want to point out there I want people to understand that it's so difficult to live your life in the public eye is so hard to put your family out there because when you put your family out there like they vlog every day you can't focus and you can't live a real life you can't be in the moment genuinely with just your family knowing that it's just you your husband and your kids no you're you're, you're aware that this this thing we're doing now lots of people are gonna watch it they that is definitely going to put them under so much pressure to always be perfect, to always do good, to always be all that. And people, some people say they are power couples, some people say they are goals. I won't advise you to like, you know, say that these people are couple goals or you want your marriage to be like this um, person's marriage when you don't know what really is happening in that marriage. People show you the only thing they want you to see, that is what they show you. So when you have an okay marriage, and you're fine with your marriage and you're praying to God that I want my marriage to be like so 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 and so and you don't know what they're going through behind closed doors you're actually cursing yourself because you don't know what the woman goes through you don't know what the man goes through so why are you putting that on yourself why are you looking at the surface and then judging from that you know people only show you what they want you to see so people should stop this couple goals and power couple and I want I want to be like you guys please like that is the more reason why when when they know that people like when they know that they have this much responsibility to like be be, be happy in front of the camera and um, show people as, as if they are living the perfect life that alone weighs so much on on, on on any human being you know so I believe that that is a part, major part of the reason why you know to me, it's my opinion. I think putting their life out there and everything. And something else I'll also say is that you know how a lot of people support them and love them. I support them, I love them. That is how some people, there might be a few, but the fact that there are still some people out there that will be ready to bring you down and leave the worst and horrible comments, you know. There are people that will actually read those comments and be like, whatever i won't they don't care but we are different as individuals so there are people that will read it and it will bother them when they lie down in their bed and they're sleeping at night they will be wondering like why did this person say this about me is it true and they'll start having that insecurity and they start feeling bad and they start feeling low and before you know it they'll be depressed and they don't feel like doing anything they feel they don't want it and everything you don't know that the comments you leave on people's page goes a long way and people will come and destroy your life like they will tell you the worst things 
for nothing so we don't know that because if you watch their vlog you know that Jamie is a very outgoing person he's he's always going out with his friend hanging out with his friend doing what he wants and all those things and Nikki is more of like you know just always staying at home and everything she used to model but she doesn't do that anymore like there's there's nothing she has actually been able to do since she got married and had her children which is understandable because it's not easy to juggle everything together but I believe as a human being she too there will be a part of her that will want to explore hang out with her friends do other things as well and if she's not getting that opportunity I think that that type of um, situation is definitely gonna weigh her down something else I want to say is that you actually think that you know they are they have lots lots of subscribers they have lots of supporters they make very good money from vlogging their life and everything and you would actually think that with the much money they with all the money they have what what else they are definitely going to be happy the reason why i'm bringing out this point is to point out to you that money cannot buy happiness once you're not happy you're not happy no matter how much you have it's a very very sad situation that both of them are actually separating you know i know there are lots of youtubers who do couple vlog a lot of them do break up like a lot of them have been breaking up and i that's why i think that it's part, like the fact that they put their life out there is part of it because like when it comes to your family and your kids you know it's i think it's like me personally i value my family time because my child is not going to be two years old again my child is not going to be one year old again so that time i have to spend with my children i want to spend that time with i don't want to hold a camera and start like that is just that's personally that's not who i am you know it's a very sad situation unfortunately the people that are going to suffer more from it are the kids you know you know the kids always want the parents to be together but i understand when you're in a situation whereby you're not happy when you're in a situation whereby separation is the best for your mental health i think you know they're actually making the right choice i believe they're going to come together and co-parent and take care of their kids together and that's just that's what matters at the end of the day so that's just what it's gonna be guys i just like to give my like one or two cents about the situation please just try to make yourself happy be happy wherever you are be grateful to god that you wake up every day i think that's the most important thing you know so just don't don't do couple goals i want to be like this person i want to be like that person you do not know anything about that person so don't say that just strive to be a better part of you and i think that is just the best way to do it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do please don't forget to like subscribe and also share this video with your friends and i'll see you guys very soon i love you guys so so much and i'll see you guys very soon bye they boy they call me burn now you